What's going on, YouTube? Snipe Show with TKO Gaming, bringing you guys Firebase Delphi weekly strategy. Man, I'm telling you guys, you have gone into a game, last game, and you get hit by a team so freaking hard that you're just like, whoa, what the hell just happened? Why is this team shitting on us? You guys are about to see that. You guys are going to see how we make a comeback. This is definitely not our best game, but I wanted to show you guys because you guys are like, man, Snipes, you be posting games where you just 5 0 teams. That's not really cool. I want to see how you guys overcome adversity. I want to know how you guys can actually overcome a tough team and beat them. Well, we're going to show you, all right? Now, this team played very, very well. I'm going to talk about what we were doing wrong, what they were doing wrong, and how you guys can then work together with your team, whether it be the worst of the worst people or the best of the best people, and it can help you guys get to the lighthouse as well. So let's start off first off. For any of you guys that do want your own Trials of Osiris run, you guys can come to our live stream. You guys can find that in the description below, twitch.tv slash realtkogaming. Second, if you want to be a part of the small giveaway for this video, we're going to be giving away 2,000 silver in this video. All you have to do is like this video, and we're going to set a goal here, guys. We're going to set a goal for 1,000 likes for this video. And all you have to do is comment down below what your favorite Trials of Osiris map is. That's it. Two steps. Like the video, comment down below your favorite Trials of Osiris map. And you have to make sure that you're a subscriber to the channel. That way we can direct message you on YouTube if you win. So make sure you do that, okay? Last thing I'm going to ask from my OG best, best, best followers is to please follow us on Twitter at RealTKOGaming. There's a secret coming up. It will only be posted on Twitter. It's only for you guys. So please do so. And I'm sure you guys will not regret it. Okay, enough of that. Now let's talk about this video. Okay, so we're getting our asses kicked. You guys are like, yo, you guys are trash. How can you guys even help people in trials? How have you possibly carried over 3,000 people in Trials of Osiris? You guys suck. I understand, buddy. All right, calm down. We're playing like ass. We are just pushing left and right by ourselves. We should not be doing that. On a map like this, I'm using a sniper rifle and everybody calls this map fire base of shotguns or I don't know what the hell the puns that they have or the nicknames they have for this map. But trust me, this is not like a look at this. This dude is shitting on us. He's headshotting people left and right. I'm over here trying to get kills and I'm getting killed from behind. They have angles on us. We are playing like a horrible 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 team now this was live on stream as well you guys saw this live you guys were a little worried because we're on our last game here not my last game the last game for geesterism we're carrying him and he does not have a mercy anymore so if he loses this we've so far wasted an hour and we have to restart now you guys know our runs are guaranteed so if we lose or if you mess up then we just go and do it again until we get it done so this is where we turn it around we were down 3-0 on this team. We realized how important this round was. We had to win it. So what we did was we made sure that we all three went different routes. Now, two of our members went into B flag and I went all the way around right. Why did I go all the way around right? The reason why is because I have a sniper rifle. So I have the range game plus I can play as a distraction. Now, obviously many teams are gonna be running stickies on this map and shotguns on this map. I could have done the same thing and most of you guys know the strategy for shotgun and hand cannon and stickies is to stay in a group don't you know wander off by yourself with a sniper rifle you want to pick angles for your team and you want to kind of play in the back that allows your team your two teammates to please be running shotguns do not have more than one sniper on this map and they can go stick around stick together get different angles and as a sniper you can bait the other team meaning you can be so far back that it'll be very hard for the other team to get you also for when you guys are playing conservative like we are now granted we are playing conservative some might say yo you guys camp you guys suck hey don't hate on us so much honestly we didn't want to waste an hour of our life be honest who the hell would want to do that okay who would want to do that now we did get dome spawn in my opinion dome spawn is the bad spawn on this map and the reason why i say that is because heavy round should almost guaranteed go to the team that spawns in a because it's just right there you can just go through and guard all the lanes from that side and you're good to go now here we realized the other team had three rounds on us. Then we got two rounds back. We were five rounds into the game. That team on the other side 
most definitely and i mean most definitely has their supers so here we want to play conservative and wait till we get our supers no this is not scories camping this is playing back so that way we can contest their supers you don't want to be stupid and die it's not smart okay now once again i said this isn't the best game that we played and my notifications were on so i'm literally in game going to my settings and turning my notifications off make sure you guys play with notification off also if you guys have vibration on your controller on please take turn that off it'll improve your aim tenfold trust me i might make a video just separately on that because a lot of people don't know that also as you guys know the weapon patch is coming people are freaking out our Trials of Osiris runs are still going to be guaranteed no matter what. Once again, you can check the description below if you want your own. Make sure you read everything in that description. We have never steered away from what we bring to the table to you guys. And for you guys to support us on stream, I mean, we average over 100 viewers when Trials is live. That means a lot. And we'd love to see more of you guys at our live streams. Honestly, a very simple system. You get to it. You earn beat bucks. You get your run. Our supporters get a little extra and that's about it now here as you guys saw these guys do have their super so what i want to do is i want to see if i can get a pick with my sniper rifle and that is exactly what i did as you guys saw and the best part was we made this guy waste his nova now i'm in a 1v1 right now and i'm so glad i was able to kill this guy and as you guys know if a grape is coming at you you make sure you slide underneath that motherfucker because that shit will hurt real bad now at this point we have come back 3-3 three, three with this team. Now we're feeling it. We're feeling good. I contemplated switching to a shotgun against this team. But you want to keep in mind that with teams that are playing so far back, it is a good idea to have one sniper rifle on your team. It opens up a lot of doors. And boy, oh boy, if that wasn't your favorite part of the damn match, Triple with the Nova Bomb, man. I was so freaking hyped when I got that. The team was hyped. That's the momentum we needed. It was beautiful. Now, we are on the attack. The other team is playing defense. However, we know that there's one or two supers still available on that team. So we don't want to play way too aggressive. We want to play to a point where we can still push in, get control of the map, but at the same time, play as a smart team. So we essentially, while we were 3-0'd, you guys are about to see that we're going to be doing some massive damage to this team. And hey, I'm not going to spoil it, but we will maybe just end the match here. So here you guys are going to see some clutch, crispy snipes. Also keep in mind that when we do get an orb down, we do not play back. We want to play as aggressive as possible. What it does is it adds pressure to the people that are still alive and they are prone to make a mistake. If they make a mistake, they whiff their super, they use their super. Look at that snipe. Oh my God. Oh my God. That was what we needed. As soon as that happened, you guys notice how aggressive our team got. We pushed in with supers. Yeah, he got his bow off, but we were already well in advance about to kill the guy so that is this map guys there's a lot of lanes stay out of those sniper lanes make sure if you attack a lane you attack with your teammate you want to double shot triple shot lanes that way you can take the other people down faster than they can take you down and here as you guys saw we glitched the last round so we had to wait here the other team was super super stubborn and they didn't want to leave but hey if you want to see this dance because we got flawless you can do that i love you guys the other team played really well no disrespect to them and thank you guys so much for all the support and love you guys show. We are almost at 50,000 subscribers on YouTube. Make sure if you guys want to see more amazing Destiny content, whether it be glitches, trials videos, weapon combos after the new weapon patch, I'm going to show you guys the best weapons to use. Everything from this Destiny to Destiny 2 to Destiny 3 is going to be here at Real TKO Gaming. Baby, I freaking love you guys. Thank you so much for the love and support. We'll see you in the stream if you're a real fan. Otherwise... If you're just a meh fan, I'll see you in the next YouTube video. No matter what you are, I love you. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.